Hey everyone, welcome back. Broadway is back in the borderland, El Paso Live, welcoming six Broadway shows to El Paso over the coming months. How long have we been waiting for this? It's been a while, <laughs> it I has. know. So joining us live to talk about the shows is El Paso Live's manager of digital media. This is Lauren Falco. You had a party last night and hyped it all up and now yes. you woke up early. Thank you for coming on with us. Yeah, it's, it was a rough morning, but I'm here. <laughs> You're here and you have exciting news for us. I do. Um, we are finally welcoming back Broadway to the Plaza Theater. It's been so long. It's actually my favorite thing to work on, so I'm very excited to have it back. Good. I know everybody. I mean, I was always checking online. When is live theater mm. coming back? When are we going to have some musicals? Yes. So let's go ahead and talk about these upcoming shows. I feel like we need a drum roll right now. I know, right? Anastasia, it's a beautiful show. Um, so it kind of follows the same idea of the film. Um, if you're familiar with the film, the animated one, uh, it talks about kind of love, romance, Soviet Russia, um, and just kind of learning who you're meant to be. Uh, it's a huge production, dazzling artwork, stage production, uh, costumes, it has kind of everything. I bet a lot of people are just really want to go to this because yes. no one has seen it. Yeah, it's a brand new show um, and it's brand new to this, to this area too. It's really, I think, only been in Albuquerque maybe, so okay. um, it's the first time coming to El Paso. All right, so mm -hmm. I'll snag some tickets for that. Also, next we have The Fiddler on the Roof. This is probably the most yes. popular, you said? Yes, it's the longest running Broadway musical um, and it's just one of my absolute favorites. Uh, it has like tradition, uh, family, faith, it just kind of combines everything and it tol tells this beautiful story about family um, and of course it has incredible music. Yeah, you mentioned tr it has tradition. It, it literally tradition? has tradition. Yes. yes. <laughs> oh, you're going to sing it for yes. us. <laughs> also for all you Beatles fans out there, it's Rain, the Best mm -hmm. of Abbey Road. I haven't yes. seen this one. So this is also kind of a newer production. Um, it has essentially the live Abbey Road album on stage performed live by the actors. So they are they have a full band, they have a live set, it's incredible. Um, and it really transports you back to the 1960s, 70s. Okay, we have a few more to tell you about. There's the Simon and Garfunkel story. Yes, which if you are familiar with Simon and Garfunkel, one of the most iconic duos in not only folk rock, but just rock in general. Mm -hmm. um, it tells you about how they met, how they kind of grew up in Queens, New York, and how they became this legendary duo. And a lot of good music. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay. And the last two shows have already been on sale, but we want to know more. When will El Pasoans finally sure. be able to see Stomp and the much anticipated Waitress? Also, we have to throw that one in there. People have been yes. waiting. I know Waitress especially. People have been like you know, holding on. Um, so Stomp and Waitress were rescheduled from last season. Um, obviously, it's been almost two years <laughs> since we've been really been able to to get it out there. But right. Stomp will come back in December 11th and 12th, and um, Waitress will be in May of next year. So okay. Okay, are the tickets kind of iffy on these? Because some people already have the tickets. Yes. So most, uh, if you're a season subscriber, you already have tickets. If you bought your tickets originally for the shows, you should also have them. If you'd like to buy more, they are still available. Um, obviously, it dwindles as we get closer to it. So I buy them soon. Okay, so everyone's going to be scrambling to the website to check yes, that out because yes. we've just been waiting so long for live performances again. I know. I'm, I've been kind of clutching my pearls waiting for them. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, wait no more. Well, just a little bit longer. Longer. Yes, just a little bit longer. Thank you so um, much, Lauren. No, thank you Thanks guys for, for having coming us. In. So exciting. All right, we'll be right back after this.